Hey everyone, welcome back to Explodey FPS. Today we are going to fix the issue where a lot of pupils are facing DirectX device hung error while using an Xbox controller. Don't worry, I will show you a quick fix. That's work for most people, so what you need to do here, guys. First of all, it's related to your GPU crashing. And what you can do here. Click on the Windows search icon, then search for Device Manager. Once you are here, find here the display adapter and the right click on your external GPU update, and then search automatically drivers. And if you have seen this error, the best drivers for your device are already installed. Then don't worry. What you need to do here? You need to search these drivers on official website. Now I'm using NVIDIA, go into the NVIDIA drivers, download the official NVIDIA drivers, And then you need to search your product over here, like I'm using NVIDIA 1060. And, and then choose your operating system. Right now, I'm using Windows 11, but if you are using Windows 10, you can go with Windows 10. And also make sure that you are using the 32-bit or 64-bit. In my case, I'm using Windows 11. And Windows 11 comes with 64-bit, so I'm going to choose the Windows 11 over here. But in your case, simply you need to open the File Explorer and the right-click on this PC, go into the Properties. And once you are here, you will see the system type. You can see 64-bit operating system. So you need to download the 64-bit, and if you have the 32-bit, you need to download the 32-bit version. Now, once you are here, Click on the Find and it will give you the download links, like it will redirect you on the download page. Now you will see probably here two drivers, the GeForce game, Ready Drivers, and then NVIDIA Studio Drivers. Game radio drivers basically optimize for gaming, and NVIDIA Studio. Drivers are basically, you know, prioritize stability and quality for creative workflow, including video editing, animation, photography, graphic design, and live streaming to studio drivers. So yeah, we are going with the game radio drivers. Click on view and then you need to click on the download. In my case, I have already the latest version, but another way, if you are using the GeForce, just right, click here on the NVIDIA icon in the hot tray icons and then open the NVIDIA GeForce experience. Once you launch this, you will see here the driver section, just go into it and then click on the check for updates. It will scan the latest drivers if available, then just click on the download button and install them in your PC. Now, the second most useful way is BIOS firmware update. So a lot of times your GPU will start crashing just because of your BIOS firmware. What you can do here, click on the Windows search bar, and then you need to find out the baseboard product, which is B450 Pro, M2V2, and open any browser. Now, search here. B450M, Pro M 2V2 drivers. It will redirect you on the official website where you can easily find the drivers and BIOS update, etc. Just click on the first website, and once you are here in the support page, you will see here the drivers and download. Now, simply you need to choose the firmware BIOS. In this case, you will see here older and the latest versions of your BIOS update. Now, the thing is, how to know that you are using currently the latest version or not. Again, you need to open the system information, and then what you need to do here, you need to go here into the BIOS version and date. So it's 4F3, and you can see at the end, 4F3. Currently, I'm using the latest version. Yeah, that's it. You need to download it. And about installation process. Simply, you can see here how to flash the BIOS SOP download. You can click on this hyperlink. It will redirect you on the video where you can see how to update your motherboard BIOS version. I hope your problem should be fixed. If you have any other question, please let me know in the comment section. I'll guide you further until then. Just take yourself. Bye-bye.